this next comment hasn't even performed, but I'm already laughing. Please give a warm welcome. This is a true legend to the gold. Hey, everyone. It's your favorite comic, Judy Gold, back here at Banana Moors. So great to be here. Uh, I just love this place. It's like home. I mean, it's really like home. I mean, it's, it's basically home. But uh, yeah, it's great to be here. Um, speaking of home, I'm in a relationship. I, uh, I'm actually a menopausal lesbian in a relationship with another menopausal lesbian, which is not easy. Because first of all, she's a therapist. So nothing I say is benign. Everything has some hidden meaning. Oh, you meant to say this, so oh, you really mean that. You know, I'm a comedian. I already hate myself. I don't need you validating everything that I think. You know what I'm saying? But it's amazing. I, I've realized I've been in relationships with women my entire adult life. And I have to say, the one thing they all have in common is that no fight ever Ends. I'm not kidding. You know, Elise and I will have a fight, um, and I think it's over. It's done. I've moved on. And then like, 20 minutes later, Elise will come over and be like, Judy, um, do you feel like we resolve that like 100%? Yeah, absolutely. Oh, okay, just checking. I just want to know. <laughs> 20 minutes go by. Judy, can we just... Um, can we just process that for a few more minutes? Because I really need to have some closure. Oh my God, absolutely, Elisa. Oh, that's so great. You know, I was just about to sit down with my book and a latte and I was thinking, oh my God, I really hope we can rehash that fight we had three days ago about how I watched an episode of The Crown and didn't tell you, which makes me a compulsive liar and is why none of my friends trust me. And I was hoping, oh, maybe we could talk about that ad nauseum, maybe take a break for dinner and then you could bring it up right before bed. How does that work? Good? Yeah, relationships are hard, but the beginning, the beginning is so good. Remember the beginning? Ah. Uh, when you were so in love and you couldn't keep your hands off each other. There were a couple of things Elisa did in the beginning of our relationship where I was like, all right, that is eventually gonna get on my nerves. But I didn't really care because, you know, we were making out all the time. It is daytime. daytime. So uh, here's one of the things I can't take anymore. So whenever Elisa sneezes, I'm not kidding. Every time she sneezes, she literally says, uh, chew. And it's like really loud. It's like. A chew! A chew! And I'm like, Lisa, what is that? She's like, it's a sneeze. I'm saying, no, that's not a sneeze. That's a sneeze plus drama you added in. No one says a chew when they sneeze. It just doesn't happen. It's not like when you pass gas, it comes out fart. <laughs> cough, cough. Sorry. All right, well, that's it for me, uh, folks. I'll see you soon at my home club. Banana Moors, don't forget to tip your wait staff. Uh, try the uh, vegan veal, and uh, I'll be here all forever. Good night, folks. Magnificent work. After hearing those smart lines, Shakespeare is like, who is this person?